Everyone wants to save money and be more frugal, but did you know that too much frugality can actually make you spend more well? In this video we're going to show you 9 frugal habits that can actually cost you big money, so keep watching until the end to find out the most underestimated habit. Habit number 1. Bargain hunting. It's great to shop around to see if you can get a better price, but relying too much on shopping for deals can actually add up in the long run. If you're spending a lot of time searching for the best deal, you're using up more of your valuable time and money. Instead, focus on finding quality products so you don't have to keep replacements as often. Consider the opportunity cost of spending hours on end searching for discounts. Instead of dedicating an excessive amount of time to bargain hunting, you could use that time to invest in personal development or focus on your career or hobbies. It's essential to recognize that the true value of a product lies not only in its price but also in its longevity and overall quality. Habit number 2. Skipping regular maintenance and repairs. Regular maintenance and repairs are essential for the proper functioning and longevity of any system or equipment. However, it is a common mistake to skip these necessary tasks. By skipping regular maintenance, small issues that could have been easily fixed can escalate into major problems. This can result in costly repairs or even complete system failures. Additionally, neglecting maintenance can lead to decreased efficiency and performance of the equipment over time. By adhering to a regular maintenance schedule and promptly addressing necessary repairs, you can prolong the lifespan of your systems or equipment. This not only saves you from costly replacements but also ensures that they continue to operate efficiently and effectively. Habit number 3. Attempting to do it yourself. It can be tempting to fix it yourself, but it can actually end up costing you more if you don't have the skills or tools to do it. Sometimes paying for professional help can end up saving you money in the long run. One of the most significant drawbacks of the DIY route is the risk of causing further damage. What might have started as a straightforward issue could quickly escalate if mishandled, resulting in higher repair costs in the end. Moreover, Certain repairs may require specialized equipment that you might not have readily available. Investing in these tools solely for a single project might not be cost-effective. Habit number 4. Using credit cards for cash back. Using credit cards can be a great way to get cash back rewards, but if you're not paying off your balance every month, all those rewards are being eaten up by high interest rates. To make the most of cash back rewards, Consider choosing credit cards that align with your spending habits and offer the best cash back rates for your most frequent purchases. Some cards may provide higher rewards for groceries, gas, or dining out, while others might focus on travel-related expenses or general purchases. By carefully selecting cards that suit your lifestyle, you can optimize your rewards potential. Habit number 5. Buying low-quality products that need frequent replacement. Low-quality products may initially seem like a more affordable option, but they often lack durability and reliability. These items are more prone to wear and tear, leading to a shorter lifespan compared to their higher-quality counterparts. As a result, consumers find themselves needing to replace these items more frequently, which can quickly add up in terms of expenses. By opting for higher-quality products, individuals can ensure that they are getting value for their money. These products are typically made with better materials and undergo rigorous testing processes, resulting in increased durability and longevity. While they may have a higher upfront cost, the investment pays off over time as they require fewer replacements. Habit number 6. Buying cheap clothes. What's cheaper now can often end up costing more in the future. Buying cheap clothes often means you have to buy more often, as cheap fabrics tend to break down quicker. Invest in quality items and they'll last you longer. One of the main drawbacks of buying inexpensive clothing is the quality of materials used. Cheap fabrics and construction techniques may not withstand the test of time and frequent wear. As a result, these clothes are more prone to wear and tear, leading to premature fading, stretching, pilling, or even rips and tears. Consequently, you may find yourself needing to replace these items more frequently which can accumulate costs over time. Habit number 7. Falling for impulse purchases and sales gimmicks. An impulse purchase refers to buying something on a whim without carefully considering its necessity or value. Sales gimmicks, on the other hand, 
are marketing strategies used by retailers to create a sense of urgency or scarcity in order to entice customers into making a purchase. One common mistake is succumbing to the pressure of limited time offers or flash sales. These tactics create a sense of urgency, making you feel like you need to buy something immediately before it's gone. However, it's important to take a step back and evaluate whether the item is truly worth the price or if it's just a result of clever marketing. Another mistake is falling for discounts that seem too good to be true. While discounts can be enticing, it's crucial to do your research and compare prices before making a purchase. Sometimes, what appears as a great deal may actually be a sales gimmick where the original price has been inflated before applying the discount. Habit number 8. Paying for subscriptions and services you don't use. It's easy to sign up for various memberships and subscriptions, often enticed by attractive offers and promotions. However, over time, we may find ourselves not fully utilizing or even forgetting about these recurring expenses. Whether it's streaming platforms, gym memberships, or software subscriptions, the costs can quietly accumulate and put a strain on our budgets. To avoid this unnecessary financial burden, it's essential to regularly review our subscriptions and services, identifying those we genuinely benefit from and canceling the ones that no longer add value to our lives. Habit number nine. Saving money on your health. Embracing frugality when it comes to food, exercise memberships, and cosmetic health products is commonly perceived as a wise and healthy practice. However, these seemingly beneficial habits can actually have adverse effects on your overall well being, potentially leading to increased medical expenses and unwanted health issues. For instance, opting for low quality, cheap processed foods like frozen dinners may significantly raise the risk of health problems. Striking a delicate balance between saving money on these items and prioritizing your quality of life is crucial to prevent substantial financial losses in the long run. Remember, not all frugal habits are bad, but it's important to make sure you're not spending more money in the long run due to certain habits.